Hello and welcome to Waybook.com. My name's Mike Banda. I'm one of the co-founders here at Waybook. It's my absolute pleasure to show you a little bit about what we do, why we do it, and how that can benefit you. We're on a mission to enable 100,000 business owners to relieve themselves and their senior leaders from the day-to-day whirlwind within their business. We're enabling business owners to easily document all of their knowledge, systems, processes, and know-how into a really easy and effective way that becomes high-impacting onboarding and training material for their teams. We started doing this because previously we'd grown and scaled a few other businesses and we realized that every time we added additional people to the team, there seemed to be a new form of chaos that formed. Now, even though we were pretty well process driven and had that documented in Google Docs on Dropbox and a few other places, there was always a bit of an uncertainty about who had what piece of information, what was the most up-to-date piece of information, who had access, who owned the data. And also, even if we were confident we'd sent the right information to the right people, we weren't necessarily confident that we were able to update them on it or that they'd even read it, seen it, or understood. Waybook becomes your single source of truth. And once you create a Waybook once and you put your knowledge or information in there, from experience, I can assure you, life becomes a little bit easier. Now, Waybook is really um, focused on having a core fundamental structure within your pieces of knowledge. You'll see here on the left-hand side, your Waybook has a series of different subjects, documents, and steps. Subjects are what you see here on the left hand side and are largely departmental piece of information like marketing or customer support um, or sales or it can be knowledge that runs across the organization like HR policies or welcome to the company. Within in each of these individual subjects you have a series of documents. The documents are essentially the core pieces of knowledge or information that you're looking to share with your team. Within sales, it could be how you conduct lead generation or discovery calls. Within HR policies, it might be the individual policies or procedures. Or in a welcome to the business, it could be a little bit about the purpose, about why you exist and what you do. Clicking into each of these individual subjects or documents, you'll be able to see that a document is made up with a series of steps. And this is really where the content and core focus of your information is. So instead of presenting someone with a wall of text, a PDF, a deck, or however you present, you can break down your knowledge into core individual pieces of information. And you can have a whole range of different types of content, be it images, text, videos, um, GIFs. You can actually embed and attach PDFs and various different files have execution checklists, code snippets, but the core thing that saved us a huge amount of time is having various different tests and assessments integrated within your workflow. So say for example, you have a new joiner, you add them into your Waybook, you put them into the right team that gives them just the right level of access that you want them to have, and they can simply start working through your content, marking as complete, adding new pieces of information, answering bits of questions, and you're able to easily see not just what they've seen, but how they understand that knowledge and information. Now you can see that my progress as a reader is updated, which means if I jump away, and I get distracted, I can always go back into what's recently viewed or what's recently been updated. I can also set bookmarks, so I have the specific core pieces of knowledge or information for me to come back to, or of course, if I ever want to get quick access to something, I can easily search whatever I'm looking for. So previously, I always used to hear where are the logo files, what's the most up-to-date version, what about this aspect ratio, whereas now someone would simply search logo into Waybook and they'll be able to find all of that knowledge and information, the specific access to the files, and they can either be embedded within Waybook or linked out to where else they live. There's a huge amount more you can do within Waybook. And from an editing perspective, we can even uh, look at previous versions of that document. So we can look at who's revised it, what's been edited. And of course, we can always compare the like-for-like -like documents to make sure that our knowledge and processes are progressing in a positive way. 
You're also able to have publicly viewable documents, which means that actually you can have a public version of any of your Waybook documents. This can be used for a whole host of different reasons. For example, we use it for our hiring process before somebody's even a part of the business and also to help onboard easily agencies and suppliers that only really need to see a small segment of our company information. There's also a huge amount of other things you can do here within, uh, within your Waybook and all of your knowledge is easy to add new steps, start typing or of course you can just go deeper into all of your individual pieces of um, content, be that various different checklists, bullet points, emojis, you name it, you're able to embed that within your Waybook. Once I've made a change within Waybook, I can publish that and I can just say whether it's a small change or if I want to reset the progress. Now, if I choose to reset the progress, that will automatically update everybody who has access to that core piece of knowledge or information, and they'll be invited back into the Waybook in order to be able to update on the uh, most recent knowledge. This could be a new step in your hiring process, a new way of welcoming customers through your shop, or of course, it could be a new way of closing sales on your sales process. Now, once you've created some of your content and knowledge within Waybook, you can then see it from, uh, from half a foot away and you're able to then optimize the way the business works rather than getting stuck into the day to day. Um, you're easily able to manage all of your team and structure and you're able to do this effortlessly by using different types of user groups. So by easily creating one group, say marketing executives, I'm able to say that these three people will have access to these four documents. And I'm also able to break down the specificity of what they're able to do within these pieces of content. So for example, they could be read only on these specific subjects, but we're gonna give them edit or publish access to the paid marketing process. This essentially means that when you're inviting in a new user, you decide how, what level of role you want them to have within your waybook, whether they're read only or they can contribute or edit. And then you can also add them to the specific groups that you want them to be able to access and control. This means that you don't always have to constantly think about who has access to what. And of course, if you ever want to change and check who has access, you can just click on that individual user and override their core pieces of access to suit you and what you want them to be able to do. One of the other core fundamental things within Waybook is being able to see the different reports and accesses people have done. So we can break this down on a per document basis and have a look at the progress that somebody's made throughout that account. So we can see here only Virage is anyone who's been clicking through on this demo account here. But we can also then check into any specific user. So say you've just onboarded a new person into your team, you can see what they've seen, when they've seen it, how far they're into that process, or of course you can just review their responses to the tests. So we can see here that Mike has passed the lighting test, but for example has failed the communication challenge. So the system will then automatically remind them to complete the content and the tests that they haven't yet completed, and you can have the peace of mind that people are always on the same page. Waybook has a huge amount of other features that are really easy for you to get into, but also we're always on hand in order for you to answer any questions um, that you may have, whether that be through um, chat and custom support, our help center articles, or you can always book on to a one-on-one -on -one with any of our process experts to help you structure, create content and build your team within Waybook. We hope that together you will have your business on the same page and you can go back to enjoying your business and growing as fast as your hopes desire. Have a great one.